Hey, what's up everybody? How's it going? Welcome back. My name is Oshi Krosu and I'm here for you guys to play some games. This is my very first ever standing intro. Just wanted to stand and do something a little bit different because this series is a little bit different on the channel. Let's get into it. I'm going to kind of explain it, what it is, what the heck we're playing, and how it's going to work. Let's go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I told you I teased this kind of thing that there was going to be a new, um, a new series on the channel. Um, this series is going to be kind of like... We're signed up for a service called uh, Keymailer. Keymailer mails us keys for review copies of games. This game here happens to be one of them. I don't know what the heck this is, but it's called Vicious Attack Llama Apocalypse. Okay, so I, it's basically, I read the review sheet. Uh, let's read it out loud here together. It is described as Rogue Code. Gave us this key, by the way, Rogue Code. All the description for all of them is gonna be in the description of the video. You guys can check them out if you're interested. Um, this week's the world's best mass llama slaughter roguelike-ish uh, couch co-op top-down twin stick shooter. Okay, um, that's, I don't know why I did the fingers, but we did it. I don't know much about this game. I don't know, I haven't played it yet. We're just gonna kind of dive in, play it for about half an hour and see what we get and where we get to. Um, yo, so we got, uh, we got a, a grill uh, uh, um, avatar there. District one, before Lamazon <laughs> switched to drones for delivery, they used llamas with LPCs, llama persuasion chips, to control their actions. Unfortunately, the Lamanati have managed to hack into the chips and take over control. Turning the llamas uh, against us to destroy everything in their never ending quest to vanquish the world of corporate greed. Our only hope is Bob. Uh, the lead Lamazon scientist who engineered the LPCs and we know him to re and, and will know how to regain control. He's hiding in the Lamazon hidden URL underground research laboratory, but the, Lam the Laminati have disrupted our comms and networks so we cannot contact him. Let's go. Oh, we play a video. Wait. I'm glad you could join us at the Lamazon Corporation. All right. Thanks for signing up to save humanity. You're welcome. I'm Melissa, your eyes in the sky, and I'll be here with you every step of the way. Okay. <laughs> A lot of cool throw arounds to, uh, to, to pop culture here. Hi, I'm Peter. I am. I mean, you don't know who I am. We are the Lamanati. Lamazon has brought Fair us enough. on themselves. Lamanati. We are Camelid. We do not forgive. We do not forget. We are Legion? Expect us. Oh, no. We are Camelid. That's the Legion. Okay, whatever. All right, cool. Uh... Damn it. I told you we needed to cut holes in the eyes. <laughs> okay, I kind of want to. I kind of want to get into it here. Okay, let's. What is deploy? A is. Okay, deploy. Okay, we're just gonna. We're just gonna hop into it. So okay. Wow, this is this is like really just into it. So we can. Okay, how do I shoot? Okay. I don't know what it's doing. Oh, okay, so I can just... Okay, so my, my two top trigger buttons will shoot for me. Okay. This feels like there was, a, there was a game for PS Plus that was out. I know this is going to be pointless for someone as smart as yourself. <laughs> but management requires that I guide you through some basic training. Uh, let's, let's go skip training. <laughs> In this for the glitz and the glama, you need to complete those challenges. Get the puns out of here. Get the puns out of here. Get the puns out of here. Bullet sandwich, one hundred percent chance. Okay, let's go. The, oh, this is okay. This kind of reminds me of like of a of a of a Smash TV. If you guys ever played Smash TV, it's an old kind of retro game. Um, okay, we know we got llamas. Yo, we got yo. Okay, no. Oh, that's a that's a strong ass llama. What is X on an Xbox controller? Okay, so I, I know we got a reload button. We got a we got a shield button going on here. Uh, we got like a cool ground stomp ability. I don't know what circle does. Triangle doesn't seem to do anything. Let's just ground stomp. Oh no, my ground stomp is out. How do I do it? How do I how do I do my jump? Boom! Okay, so so far, um, it's, it, it's, I mean, what the fuck is going on? I don't, I don't know what we're doing here. Uh, 
let's let's go skip training. Okay. I, I feel like we're just gonna run in circles the whole time until we until either we die or they all die. Watch your back. No wait, your left. No, your right. <laughs> watch your back, your left, your right. Just watch everywhere. All right. Fair enough. Okay, so so far, first impressions. Game is kind of fun. It plays like um. It plays kind of like a game I've played before. I cannot remember the title of it for the life of me. But it was basically this kind of game just done with a zombie style. Um, also played a lot of like flash games with this kind of aesthetic as well. It seems to be a popular kind of design. Okay. That's cool. You're on fire. Oh, we beat the first area. Oh dang. Okay, so let's go actually go back and uh, see if we can find... What is that? Is that none health? We don't have health packs? What the heck is this? Equip <laughs> makes the sound effect too. That's so cool. Oh, okay, so we're gonna get different guns as we kind of play through. So what is this? The Laminator, Rain of Fire. We could go double Rain of Fire, or we could go a Contra Gun. I don't know, we'll try Contra Gun. Kind of a zany game. Can we can either go one of two ways. We can go Area 3, or what's up here? Oh, this is area three as well. Okay, we're not running out a lot of health. What is, what is with what is with the sound effect? <laughs> Llamas don't make that sound. I'm pretty sure. Okay, so I can't I can't dash. I don't. How do you dash? Uh, let's let's go skip training. It says use B to dash. I'm B and I'm I'm B and well I'm X. I can't use the dash. I don't know how to dash. Rip run. Oh no, the land apocalypse. You know you're meant to be clearing the city of llamas. Yeah, right. Yeah, I know that. Thank you very much. Let's redeploy and try again. It's like okay, we can jump now. We can jump now. What the heck is? Why can't we jump here? We can jump like a mother here. Oh, I can dash all of a sudden now. New challenge just for you. New challenge? Get out of here with new challenges. Get out of here. How's that sound? Just for me. Oh, you know what? I see. We have some weird. We have some like. I see makes more sense now as we eliminate llamas we're gonna get like see that little bar over the top of our head there right beside our kill count Keep it up. there we go there we go okay okay things are things are picking up here a little bit let's go for our jump smash ba -ba 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 -ba. was that 10 that was a tenor that was a tenor right there it's raining llamas hallelujah no, stop the llama puns. They're not funny. There we go. Right there, baby. That's the ticket. We're gonna go with double rain of fire. Yeah, yeah, rain of fire. Suck it, llamas. I feel like the Reign of Fire is the best one so far. Nice work. Nice Happy work, ball. baby. Yeah, we impress Senpai. All right. Yo, we're just gonna wait till we get like that big stack around us. We'll do the big ass jump attack and crush some face. But we also wanna knock over the street lights and stuff. Let's not forget about it. Trying to break you. Watch out. Of course they are. They're sentient llamas. They know they know war tactics. They're war llamas. Well, what is that? What is that cool thing? I don't know how to use the sentry, by the way. Oh, okay, I used it. Okay, let's stick with the sentry. Where is our sentry? Oh, it just sentry's just going ham. Okay, sounds good, dude. You do you, sentry. You do you, baby. Ice spikes. Okay. 
Okay. Contraband rifle is kind of boring. Can we need two more sheet lights? Where are they? A pistol? Really? No, I want my I want my missile back. Think your weapon's nice? Wait until you see this new baby. Well, give it to us, baby. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Give it to me, baby. We're not, we're not gonna do that, but Okay. It's not glamorous, but someone's gotta <laughs> do it. <laughs> the puns are awful. The puns are terrible. We should get a couple more sheet lamps up here and get our get our challenge. Boop. Part of the part of the fun of these games is always like trying to find out what the next weapon is, what it does. Ooh, wow. So okay, strangely enough, the freeze ray does not kill them. It only stuns them. It's a pretty good stun. You know, it's pretty dang good. Be careful! I just overheard a pack of them plotting your demise. How did you overhear a pack of? <sighs> Destroy 10 mailboxes? That was our objective? I don't even see any mailboxes. Okay. Alaminator. Okay. Seems pretty cool. If this were a film, I'd call it Silence of the Llamas. Stop it! <laughs> Just stop with the buttons! What was the design process for this? You go through Reddit and say, hey, Reddit, I need llama puns. Can we get some llama puns? Any any of them will work? Out of context, in context, whatever context. I would love to have seen a boss. I, oh. <laughs> Self-destruct. <laughs> That's probably the best part of the game right there. What did I think? <laughs> what did I think of Vala? Um, you know. What what is what the heck is Vala even stand for? Something a, attack? Va I don't even know. Oh, vicious attack llama apocalypse. Okay, so for the memes, <laughs> we'll give it like for the memes we'll give it like a seven out of ten. There's a lot of llama puns in there. A lot of cute like little no notions towards like modern modern uh, modern stuff. You know, we see the the anon. We see Amazon as the Amazon for delivery drones and stuff that. You know the, the stuff they talked about there um gameplay is, is pretty cool i think it would be a lot more fun to play this with more players you know sitting on a couch it is described as a couch co-op game so if you can play this on steam you have like three or four friends in your house definitely would be a lot more fun than you know just solo play it's it's it i feel like it's probably designed a lot on that um but yeah gameplay is kind of fun uh, I like it. It's, it's kind of addicting. It's probably something really great to pick up casually play for 20 minutes here and there and uh, get down. You know, when you're when you're busy doing something, you only got 20 minutes to pop into a game. This is this is that game, I think. What the fuck did we just play? <laughs> Anyways, uh, cute game. And uh, overall, if I was to give it a rating, should we start this series out and just do ratings like uh, out of 10? An Oshi rating um, of, of buyability? Um... I don't know what the price tag on this game is. I wouldn't pay more than five bucks for it. I know that sounds kind of harsh. It's got some good, it's got good like, you know, like like cute little graphics and fun gameplay and roguelike replayability and the couch game. So maybe like seven bucks, maybe seven bucks. I would give it a, a, a four and a half out of 10 on a scale of what I buy this. I don't even know how that translates. That's not a yes or a no. That's more of a no than a yes. That's more of a, if I was at a frat party, this would be the game. You know, this this game you just put on the couch, you play it, people pick it up, put it down, that's where it's at. Hopefully you guys enjoy this. I'm, I'm excited to see what uh, games come through Key Mailer for us. This was one of them. Some of them look really great. Some of them look really shit. Um, and uh, we're just gonna like cut this episode up and see what we can get out of it. So uh, if if shooting llamas is for you, this is the uh, this is the game for you guys. <laughs> Yo, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.